Pavlov volcano is a stratovolcano of the Aleutian Range on the Alaska Peninsula. It has been one of the most active in the United States since 1980, with eruptions recorded in 1980, 1981, 1983, 1986 to 1988, 1996 to 1997, August 15 to September 13, 2007, May 13 to August 8, 2013 and most recently May 31, 2014 and continuing as of June 3, 2014. The Alaska Volcano Observatory reports on Pavlov aviation color code levels and volcano alert levels on a daily basis. With the threat score of 95, the threat from future eruptions is considered to be high. Much of this threat comes from the possibility of disruption of nearby air routes by large releases of ash. The mountain currently has basic real-time monitoring, but the USGS would like to improve instrumentation at the site the mountain shares a name with the nearby Pavlov sister, which last erupted in 1786. Geologic Activity After its eruption in 1996 the volcano entered a period of dormancy, the longest it had been dormant since records of its eruptions have been kept. This period ended on August 15, 2007, with the start of a new eruption involving seismic disturbances and a vigorous eruption of lava. Scientists said that the volcano could be working toward a massive eruption that could affect air travel but was not expected to threaten any of the towns in the area. The eruption ended on September 13. The volcano erupted again on May 13, 2013, but activity had greatly diminished by July 3, 2013, and on August 8, 2013. The current volcano alert level was reduced to normal and the current aviation color code reduced to green. A new low-level eruption began on May 31, 2014. On June 2 seismic activity intensified and officials raised the alert level from watch to warning and the aviation color code from orange to red after pilots in the area reported a smoke plume that reached as high as 22,000 feet above sea level. Climbing History The first recorded ascent of Pavlov Volcano was on June 27, 1928, by T.H. Jagger, J. Gardner, O. P. McKinley, P. A. Yachmanoff and R. H. Stewart, although speculation surrounds this ascent, which was recounted in National Geographic. The straightforward nature of the climb suggests that an earlier unrecorded ascent may have occurred. The second ascent was in June 1950 by T. P. Bank. The main challenge of climbing this peak is its remoteness and the consequent difficulty of access. The peak is a 30 miles, 48 kilometers, journey from the north side of Cold Bay. The climb itself is a straightforward snow climb, and the ski descent is recommended.